wishing you were back. Hi, Tyro. Not the same without you. No? No, I mean, Peter and Toya are great, but... Can't beat a bit of class behind the bar, you know? Bit of glamour. What do you mean that? Hey, you still got it, Liz. Don't tell Fez I said that. <laughs> thought about it and uh, all things considered the answer's yes sorry i mean we'll have to discuss terms and conditions but i'm sure we can come to an arrangement uh i haven't got a clue what you're on about the note you shoved through my letterbox last night oh and you know nothing about it no aha uh -huh. so an establishment where the man still wears the trousers don't you worry, Pet. I'll soon show you around that. Right then. I'll be in touch. So, you're alive. Hello. <sighs> you okay? Did you offer Liz McDonald a job? Me? No. Are you kidding? Well, somebody has. <sighs> Tired. So, where should we start? And you've said nothing to her? No, love. I mean, not even in, like, a, a flirty banter kind of way. That flirty she banter with Liz McDonald. Come on, what are you doing? Trying to drive me back to drink? Well, she's got it from somewhere, hasn't well, she? Well, I, I don't know. Oh, wait, hang on. No, she said something about a note. Oh, a note? Yeah, I know. I, I put a note through their door for Steve to say that it was unbarred. That's it. She's read that and she's got the wrong end of the stick. Well, didn't you address it to him? I didn't think I'd have to. OK, so what exactly did it say? Uh, something like, please come back, we miss you. Great. Oh, come on, love. Eh? That's easily sorted. Oh, really? OK, well, I will leave that to you then. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know what? You're dad. Yeah. Anyone left a functional with a faint whiff of macho jacket out the back? Mm. Ah. That's Gary's. No, oh, he's not taking it off to sumo wrestle with Kirk, I hope. Do you know, I wouldn't put it past him. Oh, and there's a load of glass out there. Where's the dusty pan and brush? Uh, there you go. Fan cool. All right. Oh, Gary's not been kicking off with you and all, I say. What's up with him? I have no idea. He went AWOL last night. Oh, he wouldn't have copped off, would he? No. Look, if you need to go and talk to him... I don't even know where he is. Don't go jump into any conclusions, though, eh? You, know, you don't want to let your imagination run away with itself. Oh, think where that would leave me with this one, eh? <laughs> right, come on, then. Pick a hand, any hand. Oh! Uh, that hand. You win. <gasps> win what? The pleasure of telling Liz McDonald that she don't have a job either. Oh, no, 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 you've got to do that, because you should have made it clearer that that note wasn't for her. I, I know, but come on, if you're braver than me. And anyway, you picked the right hand, so you've got to do it. No. Come here. Ow. Oh, wow. Lucky one wow. as well. Aren't you lucky? Go on. Good luck. Oh, don't make Go me. on. I bet you've missed me, haven't you? Hey, Liz. Hi. Right. Now, I know I'm not down to actually start yet, but consider this a free bit just for a few hours. Just to get back in the swing. I have been a doctor's receptionist for so long. <coughs> Thing is, Liz. How long has he been waiting? I love. Right, there you go. What can I get you? 